guys. This is my first vlog. I thought it'd be super fun to start and kind of show you what's going on and take you around in my life in New York City and kind of show you all my fun like work events and all that kind of fun stuff. Um, I'm also gonna do like makeup videos and fashion videos and kind of whatever I think is fun. And but yeah, I'm about to take you here on my week and my journey and um, I hope you enjoy. Right now it is Wednesday. It's the afternoon time. I went to Pilates this morning, grabbed all the packages that I have downstairs. I have like a bunch of like PR and like work packages arriving at my house that I have to get work done for. Um, but the main thing is I have to get my boyfriend's present. So in general, I'm a pretty good gift giver. Like one year I made my boyfriend a custom board game, like from like scratch. The whole thing I had like designed myself it was pretty, pretty impressive if I do say so myself. But this year, there was a lack of motivation going on. Um, so we're kind of struggling to get the gift to come to life. So I've got a few little tidbits here and there um, that I have already planned for him. But like the main gifts haven't come through yet. Like I have ideas, but I can't get them to manifest. Um, so I'll take you with me on that journey as they kind of arrive and whatever happens. Um, but right now I'm just going to run some errands. Then I'm gonna open up a couple of packages when I get home, things like that. Um, so I thought today would be a fun first day. And we have three days until Christmas, I believe, which is insane. I can't believe the year has gone by so fast. Okay, um, I've winded down a bit, did some work emails, and now I thought I would do kind of unboxing all these miscellaneous packages with you. The first one is from Brady Melville. I'm gonna need to vacuum after this because the cardboard, when I cut it open, it gets everywhere. Oh, it's so cold, oh my gosh, I must be freezing on that truck. Uh, the first thing I got is like a little black turtleneck. It's got some ribbing. I just needed a black turtleneck to layer it's freaking freezing in New York right now. I have something in my eye. Um, so that'd be cute. And then this I wasn't sure about, but I kind of thought it was cute and be like layered over a dress. It's kind of like a sheer like sweater. I don't know how I feel about this, but we'll see. And then literally this could be for anything, but it's so soft. I just, yeah, a cardigan. Okay, and then all my friends were wearing this skirt, and at first I didn't like these leather buckles, but it grew on me. It's really thick. It's pretty good. Okay. That's cute. I love that. Oh, this is cute. Little lacy t-shirt. And, of course, more of the ruffly white socks. And then I have a PR package from Motel Rocks. Um, I'm going to try to not damage the packaging because I need to do an unboxing on TikTok for them, so... I want it to look like I've just opened the package um, on TikTok. Okay, well, there I go with keeping the packaging really nice and preserved. Okay, so the first thing is this little brown floral dress, like a midi to long dress. This is so cute. I actually love this. Uh, can't wait to say all this. Very excited. And then the next piece. This is another floral dress. And it kind of buttons down. Does it button all the way down? No. Oh yes, it does. No, I don't know, I can't tell. <laughs> anyway, it's actually very cute. I really like that. It's got like a, you know, vintage -y rose pattern on it. And then this is super cute, I'm excited about this. It's a little set, so. Oh, it's got green stripes, that's pretty. I thought it had like just black and white, but I actually really like that. Okay, it's a little pinstripe halter top which I thought can be styled with anything, but it comes in this little set. And then here's the matching skirt. So cute. Okay, and then the last thing that Motel sent me, this pair of jeans, um, they're like flared and they've got like this cut off top. That's so cute. These look like they're gonna fit perfect. Ooh, very cute. Big fan of those. Put everything away now so that it's not a mess later. Look at that, I'm looking out for myself. 
And then another PR package I have is from Jill Stewart. They sent me so many piles of things. Um, I went to an event for Jill Stewart just like a couple of weeks ago and it was very, very cute. Um, it was like a little brunch service and they were giving away a bunch of makeup. But now they've sent me more. They're just these matte lipsticks, a lot of them are. And oh my God, they're so gorgeous. They're a really, really, really nice formula. And they come in this cute little case that opens and has like a little mirror. And they're these really pretty like glittery flower one. I think the other one is like a peach color. Excited to try these. Okay, and then my boyfriend's presents. So the first thing that came for the more sentimental gift is some paint markers, which I'm going to be using to craft up one of his gifts. And then let's see what's in the next one right here. I'm about to cut open. It is a fork. Okay, it's a set of two forks. They're huge. That's much bigger than I wanted them to be. Might have to use one of my own forks, but for now, those will work. And then I'm afraid for what's gonna be in this next this next package. It's gonna be shocking. Um, I might get demonetized. No, I'm not gonna get demonetized because it's a hot glue gun. Um, now you guys are just gonna have to wait and wonder what I was talking about, but I will show it to you when it gets here and then you'll know. But that might not be for a couple of vlog days, so who knows? Hi guys, okay, so we are currently on our way to an all-you-can-eat sushi place. Where last time, Roman here vomited because he ate something that like grossed him out. Um, so we're gonna try the waters again and see what happens. Good luck, Roman. Good luck, <laughs> Hi, guys. Okay, it is freezing cold in New York right now. Um, I'm currently trying to go Christmas shopping for Roman, but it has been like the worst day ever. Like, I went to Pilates this morning and went to lunch, and that was all fine. But then I went to the first store, and there was like a huge line. But there was two lines. One was for like the shoes, and one was for the normal shopping and that's what I was trying to do. So I asked them when I said, is this the right line? And they were like, yeah, that's the correct line. I waited for an hour in the freezing cold. An employee came out an hour later and was like, you're in the shoe line. If you want to go to the regular clothes line, you got to go over there. And I was like, I've been waiting an hour. Like, is there anything you can do? And he was like, nope. And the line was like four times as long. I just like, oh God, it's rough out here today. And nothing to show for it so far and it's the day before christmas eve so let's see all right hey guys i'm back i went christmas shopping today for my boyfriend he's just in the other room so i have to be quiet but i did secure some goodies i got and some stuff here um, but then I have a couple other presents that I need to make, like I said, which I'll do on camera either later today or tomorrow on Christmas Eve. Thought that it'd be fun to do another PR unboxing. Also, I got the Kin Euphorics drinks. They're really, like, good. This orange one, I like better than the purple one I have discovered. It's, like, bitter, but it's kind of, like, gingery. And it's supposed to, like, make you feel good. But this PR package is from with jean here it is i'm very excited to see what they've sent okay the first piece is this corset dress which love it's like a corset as the top but then it gets like not corset at the bottom really cute um excited to see this and try this on this floral long sleeve dress oh my gosh this is gorgeous i love this piece and then the third piece that they sent me is this it's kind of the same uh, print as the other one but it's like a short sleeve dress and it's got like a cute v-neck obsessed and then uh it came with like a little slip underneath a little nude slip which is actually very lovely so that's perfect it's so cold in the bedroom, it's actually miserable, but 
we are going to go out to dinner in like an hour and a half. So I have enough time to start the present. A couple of the other things that I was relying on from Amazon got canceled today. Not even canceled, just like rescheduled to like a date way after Christmas. So I canceled them and then I was able to reorder the item. What the hell is in this package? Okay. I know what you guys are thinking. You're thinking, what's going on here? Well, the next thing is just gonna make it more confusing. Okay, are you following now? Okay, so far so good. Right, a little, little long, but just scrunch them up, I guess. Okay, so that's good. Okay, now this I'm pretty scared about. Oh, that's a good feature. I was literally like, I'm gonna have to unbutton that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, this is maybe the first time anything has ever worked out for me this well with no bumps in the road. Okay. So good. But now for a piece of resistance. Oh my god, it's so good. <laughs> he's like probably like listening out there. He's like, what? What's going on there? And then where does this go? I feel like I should know, but where does this go? On his neck. Okay, so we're going to Korean barbecue. I did not get dressed. I just kind of threw on whatever. I have Uggs and a sweater and a big jacket. It works. It's so cold outside. I'm literally freaking out, but I'll show you our food and all of that. And I still have more stuff to make for him tonight. So I'll either work on that tonight or in the morning. Okay, so right now we are going to see a Sherlock Carol. It's like a Christmas Sherlock play. Um, earlier I went shopping for some more presents for Roman and I waited in line for this place for two hours. It was freezing cold. Um, but I really like my outfit right now and I will let you know how the show is. I'm really interested. Way too cold to be wearing that. So I layered over this big coat, but it's still gonna be way too cold. <laughs> currently making a little Christmas, what do you call this? Hot like wine? Hot sangria. Hot sangria. Um, red wine, oranges, apples. We're gonna add orange juice and cinnamon. Look how festive, Christmas Eve. Hey guys, okay, so we saw a Sherlock Carol. It was cute, it was Christmassy. It took place on Christmas Eve, so it was kind of fitting. Um, and then we came home and right now we're making a sangria. I'll show you that. Um, like a hot one, very Christmas Eve-y, I think. And now we're gonna watch Family Man? Is that what we were planning on watching tonight? We're gonna pick out a Christmas movie. And we ordered Thai food, so yes. I'm very excited to open all my presents tomorrow. I know him. You like him, he's married. He burns his paws on the daily, but that won't deter his brave panda. But wait, that's such a crazy photo. That's so nuts. What could be in this bag? What could it be? I don't know, you're gonna have to come open it. <laughs> Whoa, look at it. guys it is christmas we have found maybe the only grocery store open in manhattan so we're gonna make christmas dinner we're gonna make what are we making roman take it away we're making uh green meat casserole with stuffing that's right um very easy we're gonna make sangria again it was so good last night we got a bunch of good presents um 
Roman, I haven't shown you everything, so I'm, I'm gonna need to show you everything on camera actually before I even start to try to explain it. But yeah, it was good Christmas. I got a bunch of good stuff. I will show you everything later and try stuff on. Roman did very good. Thank you, Roman. This is not a bread. This is a foundation you build a house somebody with. <laughs> it's so dense. You really could use this as a like a block. I could like beat someone over the head with that. We can build a home. We, we could build a home together, right in the middle of Manhattan. <laughs> Thank you, Sunflower Seed Bread, for the house you've given us. Good morning, guys. All right, it is the day after Christmas. Uh, yesterday was really fun. It was a really chill Christmas. We didn't have any like parties or anything like that. Um, but hopefully next year will be a big, big celebratory Christmas because I always like it really kind of chaotic. I got Roman a bunch of really kind of cute presents. I got him some clothes. I got him like a really nice ring from Gucci. And then I got him all the panda stuff and that newspaper article and all that stuff that I made uh, by myself. So it was really nice. And then Roman got me a bunch of stuff as well. So I thought I would show it to you because I have it all hanging up on my rack right now. And then um, I just got ready. I think we're gonna go, it's Sunday right now. So I think we're gonna go get lunch and I need to pick out my jewelry I'm gonna wear and what I'm gonna wear today, all that. So I'll show you as I get ready. Okay, so the first thing he got me is this Sandy laying dress, which, oh my God, I'm obsessed. Um, we actually bought this in store together and I just kept it wrapped up until Christmas. And then he got me this Doen dress, which has got like these really cute ruffles. I'm obsessed. And then I got this really cute, like kind of slip dress, which I'm gonna like layer over long sleeves in love. And then I got this, which like all y'all are gonna think looks like, you know, like a little bit courtroomy or maybe a little bit like I'm going to get my hair done, but it's got these huge black collars and it's kind of loose fitting and it's just kind of giant and amazing. I love it. Um, and then I got this dress from Realization Par. It's like long and silky. I don't know if I love this one, so we might return this one. And then I also got this other Sandy Laying dress, which, ah, oh, I love. It has this little cutout and a little cut that goes up, which is like brown and silky. I got this really cute cardigan, which like ties the waist. I'm obsessed. And then this, oh my gosh, ballerina of my dreams. It's just a really cute little sweater with bows going down the center. And then I got this really cute white top from with Jean that he got me, which is funny because they had just sent me that press package. <laughs> so the Strokes were supposed to be playing Barclays Center on New Year's Eve. Um, so I reached out to some people, um, pulled some strings and was able to get us um, some really good tickets for New Year's Eve, but it got postponed because of COVID. So I just wrote like Strokes admission on like two pieces of paper. And I was like, we're going to a Strokes concert because it didn't get canceled, it got postponed. So. But yeah, that's everything Roman got me and I love it. It was like all on a wish list. I made it very easy for him this year. Um, but yeah, it was really, it was a nice Christmas. I'm gonna wear that necklace and I'm gonna wear these earrings. Easy peasy. Also, these are my Juicy Chews. Shout out to Juicy Chews. Uh, they make the most gorgeous rings. These ones have glitter in them. I have a bunch of Juicy Chews, but these are brand new. They just sent these to me. I absolutely love Juicy Chews and they are just like the sweetest brand ever. Hi guys, okay, this is my outfit. Um, I'm wearing the new cardigan that I showed you. I'm obsessed, I have a turtleneck underneath, it's very cold. And then I'm wearing my trench coat from Burberry. Uh, this top is from Rouge, I don't know if I said. I'm wearing some brandy jeans and I'm wearing this Burberry purse that my boyfriend got me for our anniversary a couple of years ago. Um, and then I'm gonna wear Doc Martens, but Okay, we stopped down for a little bit. It was so cold outside. I need to like rebundle up. Um, we watched a little bit of Succession. And now I think we're gonna go shopping a little bit. Day after Christmas, going shopping. That's who I am. That, that kind of encapsulates me. Um, I want a scarf from Acne. It's so cold and I don't have any like big chunky scarves. It's not true, I have a couple, but. And then um, we might play pool later tonight, but. Right. He's not happy about the mite. Okay, now before we go shopping, I had to get warmer. So I put on my 80s coat um, and my Burberry scarf and some earmuffs because it is so cold out. So I just had the funniest thing happen. So we we're waiting for another train now at the transfer. And a woman came up to me and asked if I spoke Russian. And Roman, my boyfriend, 
happens to be from Russia and that's his first language so he was able to like help her navigate to where she needed to go. She was nice. Yeah, yeah I was like he does and they started talking in Russian and he helped her find where she needed to go. He's a noble civilian. Okay, they didn't have the scarf I wanted. Sad. But uh, we're gonna walk around and then our favorite pasta place is right up the street. I'm actually really excited to show you guys this because they look insane. They're like these huge, thick, fresh noodles. They're unreal. So we're gonna go eat there. Um, yeah, we're going the wrong way. Oh, now we are at my favorite pasta place. And it's the best in the whole wide world, I swear. It's snowing. You can't really see how much, but it's a little bit. You see that? There's a few flakes of snow a minute. And you got a nice view of the emergency dentist. Why would you ever need an emergency dentist? Who needs the dentist in an emergency? Roman got no tea. He's boring. I got the fun stuff. I have the with jean press package here and the motel press package here. And then my Jeffrey Campbell pack press package is here. And I have to do um, TikToks for all of them. And I have a lot of stories I need to get up for brands. Um, but I'm being very slow. So tomorrow is going to be the big work day for me. Um, I'm gonna get done, hopefully, close to like five videos and then all the stories and all that. Okay, but I wanted to show you on camera the box is so amazing. I'm sure you've seen these on social media because they're like everywhere. So they had me pick which ones I liked and I had been wanting these for a bit, but they were sold out and they had just restocked. Um, so it's perfect. I can't remember what these are called. Oh, the obsoletes, yes. Oh my gosh, I'm actually obsessed. They're so pretty in person. I just love a big, heel like a, just a giant platform very chunky and these are so great i'm excited to style these um i think i'll do a styling video with them tomorrow which will be really fun but i'm gonna try them on now because i can't wait hi okay so i forgot to vlog earlier but right now i'm filming tiktoks it has been so hectic i got up i got ready it took me forever i broke my freaking tripod when i was setting up my little filming station and i was like debating if I wanted to go buy a new one or like what I was gonna do, but I ended up being able to just like, like kind of balance it back to like in place. It's like the phone clamp part. And I have a hot glue gun for Roman's presents that I didn't use. So I think that I might just hot glue it back together later, but it's working for now. Um, I'm currently doing the with Jean try on haul styling type of video that I'm doing right now. It's like mid afternoon. It took me like all morning to get ready. It was stupid. So the videos are going well. I did the Jeffrey Campbell video and then I just have this video and then motel to do. And then we'll see if I want to do any more after that. But I think the answer is going to be a hard no because it's already a freaking mess in here. busy so this is what all the locals do we're just walking in the middle of the street to get through fast hi guys okay so i totally forgot to wrap up the vlog um and while editing it i was like oh my god i never i never did a closing piece um my hair as you can see there's no more roots because it's been like a week and um i got my hair done today yeah i just wanted to close up the vlog say goodbye it was a pretty fun week and i'm excited to you know do more in the future and um 
look at your guys' comments and see what you want to see in the future types of videos, all that kind of fun stuff. So let me know and I hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs> Bye.